Finding a mattress under $1,000 does not mean you need to compromise quality or durability. You can find plenty of great beds under $1,000 that should last you several years and give you very good support throughout the night, if you know what to look for. And by the way, if you like what you see, there are discounts to all of the beds on this list in the description below. Let's get into it. Let's start off with one of the most comfortable beds on our list. This is the Brooklyn Bedding Essential. Brooklyn Bedding is a direct-to-consumer brand known for making a range of high-quality beds. The Essential is a hybrid model that features a strong coiled base, then comfort layers of foam on top. Our testing team found that regardless if they were a side, back, or stomach sleeper, their bodies were kept in a neutral, healthy alignment. Meanwhile, the top layer of foam cushioned joints and prevented any pressure buildup. Hybrids are known for sleeping cooler than all foam beds thanks to a coil base helping to make the bed more breathable. And that's what our testing team found here. So if you're someone who sleeps hot throughout the night, the Brooklyn Bedding Essential should keep you plenty cool throughout the evening. Now, hybrids are typically more expensive models, but the Essential is priced right. You can score a king-size version for around $850, while a queen should run you around $700 depending on the deal. Great price points for a hybrid bed. Now let's talk about the Bear Original, a top pick for side sleepers out there. It's under $700 for a queen and under $850 for a king, so you get a really high quality affordable bed. The Bear is an all foam model that slots a little firmer than many other foam beds on the market. That firmness made it ideal for side sleepers on our testing team who weighed more than 230 pounds, which is rare for beds made only with foam. But side sleepers of all weights really enjoyed this bed. They found that their hips and shoulders were well supported. And though the foam on the Bear cushioned their joints, their spines stayed in a neutral alignment. We also liked that the foam layers didn't conform too closely to our bodies, which is a thing with memory foam. That reduced the amount of heat that got trapped near our bodies and helped our testing team sleep fairly cool throughout the night. The bed also adds a cover made from salient, which is designed to reflect your body heat. Just one more feature on the bed to help you sleep cool. All right, our next bed is the Nectar Mattress, one of our overall favorites on this list. The Nectar is available as an all foam bed or a hybrid, which has a supportive coil base. You can expect to pay a little more for the hybrid version, which is typical. So to stick under $1,000, look to the foam model. And in short, we love the all foam Nectar. It's great for most side sleepers under 230 pounds since the foam layers hug your shoulders and your hips and reduce the buildup of pressure. The testing team found this was also very supportive for back and stomach sleepers. One thing that stood out, these foam layers are also great at limiting motion transfer so if you sleep with a partner or a pet, then you shouldn't notice their shifts throughout the night. Now, we did find that the foam on this model tends to heat up, so if you sleep hot, that could be an issue, but for under $700, you can get a very supportive, comfortable, all-around great pick from Nectar. Up next is the Layla Memory Foam. This is a cool bed because it's actually two beds in one. It's flippable, so one side is plush, the other is nice and firm, and you can flip them to suit your body weight and sleeping style. So how do you choose? Our side sleeping testers loved the plush side of the bed, which rates about a four on our 10 point firmness scale or a medium to soft feel. It provided enough pressure relief around their hips and shoulders and the flippable design wasn't that hard to manage. We still recommend having someone help you though. Back and stomach sleepers over 230 pounds will appreciate the firm side. Side sleepers under 230 should stick to the plush side. So if you're indecisive or maybe you just really want options, this is a great pick. This runs you a little more than others on this list. A queen size is just under $1,000, but with that added cost, you do get some choices. Finally, let's talk about the Silk and Snow Hybrid. Generally speaking, hybrids usually cost well over $1,000, but you can find the Silk and Snow Hybrid for about $700 for a queen and about $800 for a king, which are great price points. Our testing team found the Silk and Snow excelled at pressure relief. The top of this bed features three inches of plush foam that conformed to our bodies and eased typical pressure points in our shoulders and hips. Beneath that are coils that are zoned, which means you get more support in areas like your torso and hips while it's softer around your arms and legs. The result is a bed that we found most ideal for side and back sleepers, regardless of how much you weigh. And stomach sleepers over 130 pounds also were well supported. It's not often that a bed is this affordable and this versatile. So if you are looking for a bed that does a ton of things well and sleeps pretty cool too, by the way, then we think the Silk and Snow Hybrid is a great pick. 
Well, that's it for our picks for our best mattresses under $1,000. For more information on these, as well as some of our other favorites, visit sleepfoundation.org. And perhaps you need a new pillow to go with that new bed. Well, we have a roundup of all of our favorite pillows of the year right here. Thanks for watching everyone, sleep tight.